Alright, what's going on guys? So in this video here, I'm going to do a review on the Voice Caddy SC200 launch monitor. Alright, so I'm going to be talking about should you actually go out and buy this. So, so we got this, you know, did some testing on it and put it through the test to see basically if it really lived up to what everyone was saying, all the reviews, you know, the actual company here was saying that it would actually do. We wanted to put everything to the test. So what we're covering in this video is all the basic features of it. We're talking about this design and you know how it actually works and all that kind of stuff. We're talking about the price, the pros and cons, and where the best place is to actually buy one for yourself. Okay, so let's start with the first feature, and that's going to be practice mode. So basically, there's quite a few different things this can actually do. So one of them is going to be practice mode, and basically it tracks your swing speed, it tracks your ball speed, and it tracks your shot distance. Okay, so basically what you do is you put this little device here, as you can see in the picture, you basically put it behind you and you just take swings and it's going to log and track all of your speeds, your shot distance and all that kind of stuff. It's basically gonna store it so you can always refer back to it. You know, you can see how far you hit each club, all that kind of stuff, right? So this is perfect for being at the driving range and basically tracking how long you hit your clubs all this kind of stuff, your swing speed, and all that kind of stuff. Okay, so simply select your club, place the device behind you and start swing, and it's going to collect all the data, and then you can go back and refer back and check through all that stuff. So the next one is going to be target mode, and basically this is gonna help you show how consistent you are with your hits. And basically what you do is you select your target and you basically take 10 shots, so you can select any target you want. Um, you know, basically you'll input the you know, the distance and all that kind of stuff. You take 10 shots and it's gonna collect all the data and tell you how accurate you are. So it's a really good way of, you know, fine tuning your wedge, your, your, short, your short game, your wedges, all that kind of stuff, seeing how far you actually hit it and how consistent you be. So it'll basically tell you, give you a score and it'll tell you how accurate you are, all that kind of stuff. So it's a really cool thing. The next is gonna be approach mode. And basically this is going to help you improve your approach shots. You basically set everything up and then the, the device here is going to send you random distances and you're basically going to be able to hit to that distance. So maybe, you know, the first time it might be 70 yards and the next time it might be 150 yards and it's going to give you random distances. So you have to basically, you know, change your clubs. It's almost like a real game and it's almost like a challenge where it's going to give you all these stuff. You're gonna hit it, change up your club, you know, get all your shot distances in line, all that kind of stuff. And it's basically gonna give you a score and see how close you actually came to all the target sites. So it's a pretty cool thing. Each shot will have its own new distance and then you have basically adjust and you know use new clubs for whatever distance it gives you. So does it actually work? Obviously that's a big thing, right? Because if it doesn't work, there's no point of any of this, but it actually does work surprisingly well for the price. Obviously the $25,000 model is going to be a lot more accurate, but this is such a small device, you can literally carry it around and it's a fraction of the cost. So I was really actually pleased with how well and how accurate it actually was. So they do say it's about plus or minus 0.5 on average for like yardage and a plus or minus 3% on ball speed. Um, I found it was, you know, it was fairly, it was fairly close to that actually, you know, judging by, you know, laser finders, all that kind of stuff, they, they, were, they were both pretty consistent, so I was pretty pleased with that actually. But overall, I did find it to be more accurate than I first thought it would actually be, so I was really happy with that. So who should actually buy this? And this is gonna be a great device for people who actually go to the range a lot, because if you don't go to the range a lot, it's gonna be kinda hard, because it's best suited for range use. I mean, I, I mean you, you could go to a park and all that kind of stuff, but Obviously the range is going to be a lot easier. They, they already have you know, the, 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 the pre-marked distances out there and all that kind of stuff. So it just makes it a lot easier. So definitely if you do go to the range a lot, um, this is a really valuable tool that I definitely think you should have. Or if you start, struggle with distance control, so maybe you have your, 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 your seven iron or something and you know sometimes it goes a certain distance and then other times it goes a lot less or a lot more. So if you struggle with distance control, this is definitely gonna help you with consistency and being able to actually dial in your shot distance. And the final thing is if you don't know how far you hit your clubs, um, this is a really good device. Obviously there's no way of using you know, range finders because it's kind of hard to see how far you actually hit it if you're at the range or anything. So this will actually tell you um, it's pretty accurate and um, definitely a great thing to know and actually fine tune how far you actually hit your clubs. It's a super important thing to know. And most people don't actually know how far they hit each club. So this is gonna be really help for that. But 
who shouldn't buy this okay so you probably shouldn't buy this if you don't actually go to the range and practice because you know if you don't practice then you know you're not you're not really gonna have a use for it right so make sure you're actually gonna use it and you actually go to the range if you're thinking of buying this or if you basically need to improve your swing okay so if you need to improve your swing i would suggest you invest in some sort of lessons first because if you have a bad swing it doesn't really matter like your your shots are going to be off right so if you're never hitting your clubs consistently like you never you know striking the ball at the right spot all the time your 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 distance is going to fluctuate so there's no point knowing you'll, you'll never get a true reading on where you're actually hitting how far you're actually hitting all that kind of stuff so if you need to improve your swing i would suggest doing that first and then picking up a tool like this but I mean, other than that, it's a, it's a really useful tool if your shots are actually dialed in, you're really consistent and all that kind of stuff. Okay, so let's talk about some pros and cons. So the first pro is that it's extremely small and it's easy to carry around. It's actually really easy to use. I know a lot of tools and all this kind of stuff, they're kind of they're kind of hard to get the hang of, but I found this one really easy to use and that was pretty awesome. It's also fun, all right, and it also works really well. It's, it's fun because it gives you a challenge, right? It tells you how consistent you are. It's it's almost like a game. It gives you different distances and tells you how close you are and all that kind of stuff. So it's a lot more fun than just going to the range and hitting balls because it's not it's not an actual challenge, and it does actually work. It's accurate. It gives good information and all that kind of stuff. So it also collects club data and it basically tells you how far you're hitting each club, all that kind of stuff. A really useful thing to know, and also gives you a challenge. We talked about this, and that was my one of my favorite things with this actual device. Okay, so let's talk about some cons. It is a bit pricey. Um, I mean, obviously compared to the $25,000 models out there, it's not that pricey, but just for a training aid, it, it is a little bit pricey. So that was kind of one con, but you need to pretty much be at the range for full benefits. I mean, you could just go to a park and all that kind of stuff, but obviously being at a range is definitely what you need to do. So if you are going to get this, be willing to go to the range and actually get the full benefits out of this thing. But taking all that into account, it's actually worth it, okay? So I was actually really surprised with how the device performed and actually how fun it was to use. And if you do play and practice a lot and you want to really dial in your swing speed, your distance, your consistency, I'd say it's a great thing to have just because it, it, it makes practice so much more fun and actually gives you the data that you need to actually you know be able to fine tune your game and actually know how far you hit each club and all that kind of stuff. So I went pretty much went looking around to find where the cheapest place I could find this. So I will leave a link down below and that's gonna be the cheapest place, the best place that I can actually find this. Um, I looked on multiple different websites. So um, this was the cheapest at the time of this video. So go ahead and check that out now if you are interested in picking up this device. But what I'll do is I'll include a bonus here. So I have this book here and if you do buy through the link down below, I'll give you a free copy of the Consistency Report ebook. It's basically going to show you seven shortcuts you can use to drastically improve your scores overnight. Okay, so pretty much it's going to be seven things you can do to basically improve your ball striking. Seven things, um, just quick little tweaks that you can do that really help with the ball striking of your club. Okay, so basically if you decide to purchase through the link down below, simply send me an email. All right, just screenshot your receipt, send me an email, and I'll give you a free copy. My email will be down below. So. That's pretty much going to be it for this video. Hope you enjoyed. If you have any questions, drop them down below and we will see you in the next video.